picture this. You're standing in front of your team, armed with months of hard work and groundbreaking results. Your slides are polished, your data is rock solid. But as soon as you open your mouth to speak English, sound familiar? Trust me, I've been there too. It's like trying to explain quantum physics while riding a unicycle in a language that's not your first. But here's the secret. You don't have to be Shakespeare to nail your tech presentations. You just need a toolbox of killer phrases that will make you sound like a pro even when you're shaking in your boots. So are you ready to transform from a nervous presenter into a confident communication guru? Great. Let's dive into the world of powerful English phrases that'll make your next presentation smoother than a freshly graded access road. But first, let me ask you, what's your biggest fear when presenting in English? Drop it in the comments below. I bet you're not alone. Now let's get this presentation started. There's no doubt about it. First impressions matter. Here's how you can start your presentation smoothly and set the right tone from the start. Good morning, everyone. Today I'll be discussing before we dive into the details, I'd like to provide an overview of. This helps you control the flow and keep your audience engaged from the start. Then they'll overlook any little hiccups that may happen later on. Now comes the tricky part. Presenting your technical findings in a clear way. Here are a few key phrases. As you can see from this graph, the data shows these results indicate that one key takeaway from these figures is these phrases guide your audience through the numbers and highlight the most important points. If you're dealing with complex information, which let's be honest is pretty common in technical presentations, you want to make sure that your audience follows along. Let me break this down for you. To simplify, what this means is, in other words, the data suggests these phrases make sure your message lands clearly, even if the content is a bit heavy. Handling questions with confidence is key to maintaining control during your presentation. Here are some ways to respond effectively. That's a great question. Let me explain. I see your point. Let me clarify. If I understand correctly, you're asking about these responses help you buy a little time to think while keeping the conversation professional and clear. And finally, wrapping up your presentation is just as important as starting it. You want to leave your audience with a strong message. In conclusion, the data clearly supports to summarise, the key takeaway is, I'd like to leave you with this final thought. Always end with something memorable to leave a lasting impact. And now I'll wrap up this presentation. If you found these phrases helpful, make sure you like the video and subscribe for more English communication tips that'll help you succeed in your career. And remember, it's not about being perfect. It's about using the right tool 
tools to communicate your ideas clearly and effectively. If you want more help preparing for your next presentation, check out my free resources in the description below, including a free pronunciation workshop to help you sound even more confident. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.